Hello, y'all. So I'm in Walmart picking up a few items. I had needed some more dish detergent, but they got these these little bottles on sale for a dollar. So y'all know I'm a Dawn girl, so I got me two of them because it was only a dollar. And I'm going to try this right here. I got to um, clean my stove. But somebody told me that this Bars Keeper was better than Ajax because you know I'm an Ajax generation. So I'm going to try this here. I got that. Got me some more um, forks and spoons. Um, I need another wheel cover for my um, steering wheel. I didn't really want this one here. I mean, it is a cheaper one. I think it's only $5. But those other ones are so hard to put on. And the guy that usually helped me in the back in automotive put it on, he's not here today. And um, I asked the other uh, associate to help me, but uh, he told me to go ask somebody else, child. <laughs> I declare he did. I said, okay, thank you. He said, okay, he don't do that. But, I mean, he worked back there, but he said, uh, go ask somebody else. So, anyway, this is where we are. So, this one here seems, don't seem as hard for me to be able to put on. So, I'm going to just get this one here and put this on until um, another time I get to come in here and find that other associate. But, anyway, and I got me some Tide detergent. But let me tell y'all something. If y'all come in the store and y'all see these right here, and y'all see these Chessman butter cookies run, do not buy these. Because I'm telling you, they are so good. They are so good. So if you don't want to be have another addiction on your list, do not buy these. Who is them? Pepper Ridge Farms Chessman butter cookies. Because they're good. Don't buy them. All right, let me go on a little further, y'all. <sighs> okay, y'all, so I'm over here looking at the different cheeses. I was watching um, Monroe Steel, and she had purchased a cheese. Well, she didn't get it out of Walmart, but she had got it out of a... Uh, I forgot what store she had went into, but I'm assuming everybody probably carry them. But it was a dairy-free cheese, and she said it was really, really good. And I wanted to try it, but I don't see it over here. Dublin Jack. Oh, Lord Jesus. What is this? Ghost pepper cheddar. Oh, that's hot. I don't want that. Uh, anyway, I wanted to try that cheese because y'all know I don't, I care not to have stuff that's got dairy in it. But, um, Gouda cheese. Y'all ever tried any Gouda cheese? I want some dairy-free cheese. And she said it was really good. But I showed on. I don't see any. And I'm scared to ask somebody. Smoked. Hmm. All right, let me try to go on the other side. I see this cheese here, y'all. I ain't got my glasses on, but I don't see where it say dairy-free. It says aged over five months, gluten-free. Do y'all see where it say dairy-free? I don't see where it say dairy-free. Mm. All right. All right, y'all. I'm going to get me some corn. What's the date on this corn? February 11th. That's good. Oh, that look like it's rotten. I don't want that. I'm going to get this one. Some corn. And here goes some cheese over here, y'all. What does cheese say? It's a plant-based cheese. Mm. That's probably... Oh, here for some dairy-free cheese. Smoked Gouda. Dairy-free cheese. Vegan. Lactose-free. Girl, that's me right there. That's not the one she had. Is that a block? I'm going to try this right here, y'all, and see what happens. Let's try that. Y'all ever try this? But it's, um, Lord, it's $5.18. Praise him. But, uh, 
Follow your heart. That's what it say. I'm going to try this right here, y'all. It's dairy-free cheese. Lord knows I need that in my life. All right, y'all. I think that's it for me. I'm getting ready to go ahead and head to the house. Got my little animals. Okay, y'all. I'm off here with, with the accessories. Look what I found, y'all. I had it say, be kind. And I got some bumblebee uh, earrings. And y'all see, I got my little bumblebee cup. Wouldn't that be cute? Be kind. How much is this hat? Is it eight dollars? Oh, that's so cute. I don't even wear hats, but I probably would wear that because it's got that little bumblebee on it. All right, let me go a little further. There were some nice cups there, but they're not the Stanley cups. Oh, they got a bumblebee cup. Be humble, be gentle. Oh, this is nice. Be humble, be gentle, be patient, be loving. Ephesians 4 and 12. Now, I like a cup that's got the Bible on it. Bless, girl. I'm saved. <laughs> that's so cute, though. How much is this cup? $15.97? Mm, be put back. <laughs> be put back. All right. Let me go a little further. I'm going to have the jewelry, you all. I don't need no jewelry. But ain't that cute? A gold neck has got a little rose on it. That is so cute. It's only $2, too. That is so cute. But I know it's going to be done turn orange by Friday. <sighs> so I better just keep my little $2. Oh, this is cute. One wear and share one. I would wear one and give my other one to the, my daughter. That's cute right there. I always have the cutest little jewelry. Mm -hmm. But I don't need no jewelry. I don't need no jewelry. All right, let me go a little further. I do need a key ring, though, because my key ring is total to pieces. This is cute. Y'all like that key ring? I like that one. That green one's pretty, too. What's that? Oh, them some, oh, those are some pink earrings. Those are cute. They're in the wrong place. Ain't them cute? They're pink. Those are cute. Oh, I wait and get me another key ring. All right, let me go a little further. All right, y'all, I need some bedroom shoes. Now, my daughter got a pair of these. She said they are so comfortable. My sister bought them for her when she was pregnant. And um, she said they color, but look at these. Oh, I love these. Oh, I thought it was mixed match. This, what is that? An, is that an owl? It looks like an owl, don't it? They look so comfortable. I might get these. One size fit all. I think I'm going to get these. Yeah, I'm going to get these right here. I need some on my feet. My feet be so cold. They got a lot of different ones, though. I think I'm going to get them because my daughter said they was, she said they was real comfortable. So, I'm going to get them. All right, let me go a little further. Oh, Lord Jesus. Um, I'm on my way to food line because my daughter, she wanted me to get her some bananas from Food Line and some lime chips and some chunky guacamole. She likes Food Line's uh, vegetables and produce better than she do um, Walmart. So I'm coming over here to um, right up here to Food Line and get this. And I shall return. Alright y'all, so we are in food line and I'm here to get bananas, guacamole. I think I need to go this way. Ooh, there's some pretty flowers. Those are beautiful. Ooh, I'm a food line always got the prettiest flowers. 
Oh, those are pretty. Okay, that's not what I come for. All right, y'all, let me go over here and find these bananas. Bananas. Oh, I need a bar, just a single bar that does surface. Girl, that can't be $2.29. Just for one bar, does it? That needs to be like 98 cents. Mm -mm. I'd rather buy a whole pack for that price. Oh, God. Bananas, bananas, bananas. Okay, here they are. Ooh, these are the bananas. Guess I'll get those right there. Hey, how you doing? I'm doing fine. Great, I haven't no, seen you. you. Me too, I, I look. <laughs> yes, sir, how you been doing? I've been doing good. Great, great, you still preaching? Trying to. Yes, sir. You still with our pastor? Uh, all right, all right. I understand. I understand. Just do do the best that you can. Yes, it's difficult. I understand. All right, y'all. Well, you take care. You too. I got the bananas. The bananas were, mm, didn't look too good. That's all they had right, right there. All right, y'all. So I got my daughter. She wanted these uh, organic sea salt and lime uh, chips. And she wanted some chunky guacamole. She said they are so good together, the lime chips. And she wanted a Twix bar, a Sneaker bar, and I got me a can of these boiled peanuts, and I got the bananas, and I also got me a popcorn. That's it. All right, y'all, so that's it for my out and about, I guess. Uh-huh. I guess I'll head on to the house now. Gonna see y'all later. Hey y'all, y'all ever try these chips here? Sweet Maui onion. I try these. Then they got the sea salt and vinegar. And they got the um original sea salt. They like a dollar and twenty-nine. I'm gonna try these. This is a little snack I can take to work too. Sweet Maui onion. I'm gonna try those. All right. Y'all ever go out to shop and you're going out for one purpose, but you go out and buy everything but what you came for? That's what's just happened to me. So now, home and remembered, child, you forgot to get the turkey dogs because I'm having um hot dogs. Well, what in the world is going on with that? I don't know what's going on with my camera. But anyway, you for, you forget to get the main thing that you went to the store for. I done picked up everything. Then went to two stores, picked up everything but the main thing what I was supposed to be in getting. So now I got to go all the way back to this store or to another store that's closer and get what I'm supposed to be getting because I'm having turkey dogs today because I wanted me a good old hot dog. And the store that's close to me, they usually don't have coleslaw, but I'm hoping they got the coleslaw because what is a hot dog without coleslaw? It ain't a hot dog. You got to have coleslaw on a hot dog for it to be a hot dog. So I'm hoping they got it when I get in this though. But I picked up everything what I needed, but what I the main thing I came for. Oh, oh Lordy, Lordy, Lordy. All right, y'all. So let me 
try to get over here and get it. Okay, y'all, so this store here, they have the coleslaw, but they don't have turkey hot dogs. They got these that's made with chicken and pork. Uh, so I've already put the other ones in my buggy. I got those. They're made with, they're just chicken hot dogs. I'd rather get the chicken hot dogs than the pork and beef. Well, I'll get those. They don't have turkey hot dogs. It's really what I want. They got one that's got turkey, but it's turkey and pork. Why would you mix turkey and pork together? I don't know. But anyway, beef. Those are beef. Anyway, y'all. Y'all ain't gonna believe what I just did. I came in here and had to turn around because I left my keys in the car. And not only did I leave my keys in the car, but I locked my keys in the car. But thank God for a spare. I always keep my spare key on me. So I was able to get back in my car. But, uh, yeah, that's why they're supposed to get old buns. Hot dog buns. Let me get the hot dog buns. And I think that's it. I got onions at the house. I got mustard. Because that's all I put on my hot dog is onions, mustard, and coleslaw. That's it. And that's all. So I got these chicken hot dogs. Uh, oh, they got some chicken over here. Oh, that ain't bad. $7. $7 for that big pack of chicken. That ain't bad. Oh, that's $4. $4.66 for that big pack of chicken. And that one is $3. Oh, my goodness. I hope it's real chicken. You really can't beat that for $3.39. This a real chicken leg. I'm going to get this pack of chicken, honey. Yes, I am. You can't beat them prices right there. And then there's the, um, I'm going to get a big pack of chicken, y'all. It's all right. And once I put it in some heat, if it start jumping, I know it won't real chicken because I know they are making this stuff. Um, you know, in a lab or whatever you call it. What it oh rose, rose. Hamburger. I mean the um you know I need some um no you don't eat that. You do not need that. Hot dog rolls. Let me get my hot dog rolls and get out of here. I'll be walking around and picking up some more stuff that I don't need. Hot dog rolls. I don't even know where the bread is at in this store. Oh, there it is. The bread is down. Did I mash play? Yeah, okay. I am good for not mashing play. <sighs> All right, y'all. This is it. I'm closing out my video for today. This is it, and I'm headed back to the house. Oh, y'all tried that sandwich uh, where the onion is the... Um, the bread, you put your hamburger meat, your cheese, and you cook your onion and set the onion, you know, on top of the hamburger meat and use the onion for your bread. I'm going to do that, but I'm not going to use hamburger meat. I'm going to use turkey meat to do mine. And I'll try to come on and make a video when I do it. Lord, they ain't even got no hot dog. These hot dog buns. That's a, that's a, um, oh, here they go right here. All right, y'all. I'm gone. Y'all have a great week. That's all I got. That chicken do look pretty, y'all. Go down it. It look good. I declare it look good to me. For three dollars, you can't beat that. Most time, that chicken like that's what twenty one dollars or something. Mm -hmm.